the casting some spells. GH is coming across though. Mind Control does have this slithering crush. Could set up for another arrow here. GH pressure's on this time. They can connect onto No Tail. In range, they will get. Arrow's gonna follow as well. No Tail locked down. I'm guessing this is gonna be first blood. No Tail, no counterplay. He's gonna end up dropping. That's a nice for Void. Because Jaro's a hero who needs to go into the fights, and Faces Void loves playing against those lineups. Because it's like, you can get the easier chronos, you know? Whoa, ILTW! Wow. Oh no! Yeah, he got misstep. killed in way. Maledict comes through. Miracle needs a bash here, really, and he won't find it. So Topson made run himself away as Topson oh, getting they... jumped in the middle lane. They're gonna be able to bring him down. Weeha and GH find a kill in the mid. -me the big kill. Now this is fighting down here at bottom over the bounty rune here. It looks like Kuseb is taking oh, a lot of damage miss. inside the Maledict, but he wants to try and get the kill. But the arrow connects from GH, bringing down Seb and saving Kuroki in the pro. This is what allows him to make plays on the map. Yeah. Meanwhile, Phoenix getting very low up here in the top lane. Can I finish the job though? The Axis come spinning on through. The Star Storm, it's not enough, but GH will do it with the right clicks now. They're looking for revenge. LTW can't close the gap onto GH. He's still got another leap available and gonna salve himself up and come back in. They might be looking for the play onto the Troll Wall. The Troll Wall is trying to bring down Mind Control. Mind Control, he's got himself a Slithering Crush. They have an arrow an available arrow. as well. This could be dangerous for LTW as he gets Slithering Crush. Arrow to follow. They're controlling him up so well. The two plays from Nigma stopping LTW from finding himself a kill. And now the Thunder Rad. Gods comes down, finishes the job get bad cool. he has got regen coming out to him i believe oh, he yeah, was not out, but he's going in for this kill tp across it's not going to be there in time though mind control is going to get the kill rtw coming across for a bit of revenge throws down the axe i think mind control knows he's dead here but is he turning around gets the bash running away range axe finds him brings him down mind control does die for that one not entirely sure if that checks out as being worth it what say you david oh you know it was not worth it tops in mid though he was diving weed. There's so much Jeez. DP support coming in <laughs> for weed. Jeez. And Miracle sticks around here. There is a Chrono up plus Mask of Madness. He might just die once again. But instead, they're going to go for Saxa. They just want to secure the kill. Oh, that the courier. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. They bring them both down. Yeah, Miracle has a healing sob and Mask of Madness. He's okay to just go back after this. There's a rocket coming in, though. Oh, uh, that miracle. Might be a dead miracle. Miracle. Oh, God, that hurts. Meanwhile, Weeha's got to drop the ultimate on the back line, trying to bring down Thompson with a Maledict on him. He will certainly fall, but they get the return kill onto Kuroki. We playing in the river, but ILTW trying to get on top of him. He's going to slow him down with the ranged axes. Run down. He doesn't really have the damage to get Bill. Chill out and get himself back. I would say that was pretty worth it for OG. Not only did it Bottom lane, Seb, trying to fight kill. up, drops the RP down onto GH. He's solo. GH just needs one more right click, finds oh. it, gets the kill. Seb will fall. GH gets the solo kill. On Arrowed down in the bottom lane if they want to make this happen. Looks like they do. Yeah. Crew and GH, they're in the neighborhood. There's your Chronosphere coming down. Saxa's so going to drop in, though. Throw so the disruption. Good. That means the arrow is going to miss as well. Perfect positioning from Saxa to save Seb, wasting the Chrono. And now they're looking for the turnaround. Kuroki's going to be the target. He's going to try and drop the Death Ward onto Thompson. Thompson dropping pretty low. And the Thunder God Trap as well. They're going to tear through him like butter. Meanwhile, GH, he's taken a step too far and gets cut down by LTW. They are going to be able to make the trades here, but Thompson does die. Draw some blood. They have this Blink Dagger on Mind Control. They want to make some use of this timing. No tail could be the target. He's hugging that tower pretty closely though. This is not a subtle gank at the same time. Not much no tail can do about it anyway as mind control comes on through. The lightning bolt will finish the job. Arrow not even needed. Now we get the clean kill onto Phoenix and look to take this last outer tower. But he needs to be careful. Oh, yeah, yeah that's he's straight on him here. Pretty Jump dead. In, stun, lightning bolts, Topson. He's got a cross phase on him, trying to run away. Miracle is on him. The disruption comes through, but that just means Sax is going to die as well, more than anything. Both heroes will drop. The Death Ward from Kroki, pretty damn good. Even getting some hits up onto ILTW here. A corrosive A's Death Ward ain't nothing to mess with. Seb trying to come down, looking for the RP. Can't find himself a target. Could drop it onto Mind Control Egg. if he really wants, but he's actually out of mana right now as No Tail will fall. And Seb, he's actually in a really awkward position. The whole of Nigma coming in. It's some chain feeding going on right now. Mind Control jumping forward, looking for the plus one. They want to bring down RTW. He pops the ultimate to try and turn around onto mind control. Getting himself at least one kill here would be something, but that's all it's going to be. Just the one, as Miracle will put him to sleep. Full control of this game. I was going to say, I love Wii's gameplay to this game. He's just been so active. Like, after... Oh, GH. No oh, wow. way, dude. Oh, wow. They this nail guy. him. They take him down. He doesn't even need to see the targets to get the arrows off. <laughs> He's actually ahead of the Magnus now in network. Goodness gracious, this just isn't going how they expect. Mind control blink up to the high ground, we'll be alright. OG, 
They actually might not realize they're getting jumped here as the Moonlight Shadowed Heroes are making their way in. They're jumping onto this one. The Supernova comes down, but the Chronosphere comes down on top of it. Miracle just wants to take it down, crack that egg as quickly as possible. Seb threatening with the RP, but they're just keeping their distance. They're baiting him out beautifully. Seb cannot get off his spells. He's going to have a skewer in one second, but unfortunately, even if he does drop down that ultimate, it's not going to make much of a difference as they will finish him off. And now looking towards Roshan. Oh, guess what? We've got a Slada, so this Roshan is going to go down very quickly indeed. That Corrosive Haze might so still here. Very yeah. good play from Weeha. He's playing. He's been playing so well this game on Wii. This is like one of his heroes. He has like three heroes that he plays exceptionally well. Thompson comes into the middle lane, gets that Chronos Phase put upon him. The arrow will not connect, fortunately, but Miracle's coming in, dropping the Chronos Phase onto two heroes. So this was perfect Chronos Phase, catching out the Phoenix. And that's a double kill for Miracle. Well earned as well. And he's even looking across to RTW. RTW doesn't want to pop the ultimate here, but might have no choice. He's going to have to pop the BKB at least. Now turns around, starts throwing some axes away of Miracle, but the 10 second BKB just does. Miracle has 4,000 gold in the bank. Okay. Making some good investments. It's like, I, I actually thought he just got treads like not too long ago. The man's already got 4,000 gold and is about to take a tier two tower. Saxa has fallen. We use the next target we here. Top. In comes the cooldown on top of the Zeus. However, have they finished the job here? He will be able to do so. Thompson finds one. Oh, Look at the GH as well. He might not be that safe. Meanwhile, no tail going down in the bottom lane. The homing missile coming through onto GH. He's got that Yulzo, but Thompson gets on top of him. He has got the rocket barrage. Trying to finish the job here. Desperately hunting for the kill. Gets it. Gets Ooh. a double kill. Kuro okay. will finish the job on him. But Seb waiting behind to counter any kind of play onto ILTW with a... Reverse polarity or a disruption. Both ah, options. they also got Miracle's Aegis, by the way. Great Waddle catch from Mind Control top. here. Finding Saxa in the river. Saxa will be able to turn around and drop down the Dominic Purge. The RP coming down onto the two of them. They might be able to run through the face of Huge. Void. Do they have the damage? Yes, they do. The Void is dead. And they're going to be able to follow up with the kill onto Mind Control as well. Pops How are they too. doing this? They're looking for more. Wii's going to be the next target. They've got that homing missile coming out onto him. So Invis isn't doing much good here. RTW trying to close that gap. He's got the axes coming down. OGR not stopping the train. Has left the station. And Wii's getting run over. Kuro on the high ground. Might be the plus one here. LTW and Seb, they're looking for it. Axe is coming down onto the Witch Doctor. Beautiful arrow from GH, though. They're coming up with the Death Ward. They're going to kill off the Troll Warlord. I don't believe it. The support duo from Nigma play it perfectly. They are going to lose Hero in the end, but by every stretch of the imagination. I mean, with the smoke and a chrono, that's pretty scary. It's, yeah. Radiant uh, are scanning. If they knew about this, they would be much more scared than they are now. Oh, you're actually smoking up into this. This could be very, very bad if they can get off their damage. They're going to lose no tails straight off the bat. The disruption does come through. They're going to want to get off the supernova. Does do so, but GH immediately jumping in. But they actually want to back themselves away. They're realizing the threat of the RP is huge, but the RP is countered by the Chronosphere from Miracles. He's been able to take down two, but now the RP comes out and the ultimate from RTW chopping through the face of this void. Is it going to be enough? The root comes in. Stop the time wall. They bring him down. The void is out of here. And now they're looking for Weehar as well. He's got the TP away there's nothing to cancel he's gone you play all this turnaround has come from Thompson's play in the top lane since then that's how they've been able to find things mind control jumping onto Thompson He's just going to turn around, drop the E-Blade, slow him down, Sax is in as well, drop oh, the Demonic no. Purge, nice that's come through as well with the Orchid Barrage. That's interesting. All the heroes, because they all moved away from the pit to try and help uh, Miracle with the set fake. So a lot of mind games going on. Oh, Miracle is setting up for a beautiful three-man chrono. chrono sphere onto the supports all caught in the river. And now ILTW, he's not a support. He's a big boy. He's just getting taken down, pounded by the Death Ward. Is there anything right. you can do about this, OG? Doesn't look like it. They are looking for the Zeus, though. Tossum finds the one turnaround kill. He's actually going up the high ground for more. Mind control and Kroki ready to wait him here. Is that? Oh, no. The RP combo up the destruction or this comboed here as Zeb makes a nice blink up to the high ground. It's okay. They're buying time for Thompson to do his thing in the back lines. He's bullying Kuro and GH, or is it the other way around? I can't quite tell with this guy. He's able to take down one. Ethereal Blade comes down onto the other. Missile's going to come down as well. GH, he does dodge out the missile. And he actually knows he needs to get away. Zeb, though, with the skewer, no they get way. the kill. Thompson, man. This guy is just playing this hero like it's 2025. Meanwhile, Miracle into the trees, making the TP away. They won't meta stuff. Yeah. It's going to be pretty annoying to try and prepare for Thompson. Like, ah, I'm sure he's going to do this uh, Morphling Earth Spirit Mila. Oh, no, he's picked Magic Damage Gyro this time. Great. Throw those papers out the window. But Nengamaru by no means out of this one. And with ILTW walking up to the high ground, serving himself up the path. Oh, That's going to allow the come out. They've got out Thompson. Can they bring him down? Do they have the damage? It looks like they do. Thompson, though, gets off the Ethereal Blade at the very last second. Now the BKB as well. He's going to survive through this. Miracle actually has to retreat. GH is coming in, though. He wants this kill so badly. He wants to bring him down. But the BKB is still going. They might get the return kill. But Wee blinks in. Finishes off with the Lightning 
Vault. This is Nygma's fight. Three heroes dead, along with the carry and the mid laner. It's already over for OG. They just need to try and get themselves out of there. No tail though, unfortunately, does not have the Icarus dive. He's got 20 charges on his holy locket. I only just noticed he had a holy locket, but it's not going to save him here, unfortunately. The big Chad in the front lines threatening Nygma to come and attack him. No supernova, no worries. We don't need that stupid spell. Meanwhile, uh, my control jumping onto the troll wall of troll is getting pretty low here. Might want to consider popping that BKB and finishing the job, and we'll do exactly that. Now sees Miracle. Miracle pops a Chronosphere down. That means because BKB is going to end and he's going to get completely sh after using it. That was yeah. kind of awkward. It was. In the last engagement. I, I really didn't understand why the Troll Warlord kept the Nygma, they're it. looking oh. for Sep. They get on top of him. They've got the bashes coming on down. My goodness. The madman. This kid knows no breaks. There's <laughs> a courier running around his face. <laughs> Miracle basically saying, I see you. I see you. I know what's going on. It's just going to be a, I've got a chrono deal. Fit. Yeah. Like, how does he not get chrono here is my question. Well, need to I guess fight. we're going to find out. Let's see. Thompson running up onto the high ground. They're able to take down Mind Control straight off the bat. They've got the Zeus. He's in some trouble as well. In fact, no one's coming to save him. There is no chrono sphere available. Williams in inside the Roche pit. He jumps in. Miracle is going to be able to grab that. He just grabs her. Use it immediately. Locks down the troll warlord for the duration. Is it enough? Yes, it is. Miracle finds the value and gets two kills. What a player. He brings them both down. Meanwhile, Thompson still trying to fight, but it's one man versus the world. The man never wins in that occasion. He's going to fall as well. A dieback from Sep makes this really, really... But uh, it's very tempting for him to jump here. It might be more than tempting as I use the Thunder Gods to get the vision down. Miracle going to jump in the back lines, try and find Seb, thinking about dropping the Chronosphere. Doesn't want to do so straight away. Meanwhile, the Nimbus comes down. Chronosphere, that is so good. Catches Phoenix and the Magnus, but he actually can't jump away. RTW gets the chain roots out onto him. Seb now going to drop the RP. They they might be able to take away his first life, but he actually drags him back under the tier two tower. Not quite sure if Seb wants to be alone with this void, but they're going to chase him away. Interesting fight as they do bring down the Zeus in the back lines. We are being dead. The they rest can of the get him team, twice. they're nearby-ish. But they've got a lot to do here. They need to kill Miracle twice over with Mind Control waiting to jump in with the Bash. Will do so, allowing Miracle to try and turn around. He's got that Satanic try and keep himself alive, but he is going to die. Aegis will pop. He has the cheese. He is ready to come back for life number two. Mind Control also trying to jump in and help him out, turning around onto RTW. RTW gets off the ultimate, though, fighting up with Miracle. Miracle can't win this engagement, or can he as he fights him into him? No way. There is no way. Supernova comes crashing down. Miracle dies for the second time around. Meanwhile, GH finds a pick on the back line, but now we'll be be punished or well, Karo's gonna be punished for it as he gets dragged back in by it's good to just kind of swoop in and blast it but yeah I kind of want to see the spell prism on the shadow demon myself but oh Karo oh he's got the telescope actually yeah yeah he's been dragged out of position mind control jumping into this one as well I mean they are gonna be able to kill off Kuro very easily mind control needs to run himself away meanwhile the back lines uh oh Jared Koptik tries to go for the backstab players but gets himself killed off St misstep from Thompson gets him killed and he has no buyback this could be very costly for OG yeah Thompson's backstab plays can only work so many times in one game yeah, before right. they start to realize what his plan is. We all know Tail forced to pop that supernova right here as they get on top of mind control. Hey, He's losing his health pretty quickly. The Yules oh, no comes bash. out though to try and control him up, but it's not gonna matter, or is it? The Sunray coming through, but he's got the BKB to keep himself alive. Meanwhile, GH jumps on top of Sax, but Sax is gonna turn around, drop the disruption. Now GH could be the one in some trouble. He's got the hex out onto the troll warlord, trying to control ILTW. He's got himself a battle trance available as well, along with the BKB. Not an easy target to bring down by any stretch of the imagination. Very tense it's been moment such a here treat. in that. Yeah, they're looking. <laughs> Mind control. Oh, Wrapping around. Where are they going to find? They want Seb. They want Seb. He doesn't have a buyback. Seb. Yeah, He's true, a short true. kill. Yes, indeed. In the trees, Thunder God's going to find it. Are they going to go in for it? Miracle. They He's got, got the Chronosphere available. And they will be able to drop it down onto the Magnus. But in comes a disruption from down the map. They do save him. RP. Keep him alive a little bit longer. But he can't get off the RP anyway. He is dead. LTW in some trouble. Popping that ultimate. Trying to turn it around onto the Faceless Void. But the Faceless Void is more than happy to tank up into this one. And now he's got the Satanic coming out the other side. He's going to be able to drop the Troll Warlord. Troll Warlord is dead. He has himself a buyback. But he does not want to use it. Saxa coming back into this one as well. Trying to fight up with tops. And yours comes out the Shadow Demon, the arrows coming through as well. Multi shot Die arrows back. coming out in every which direction. No buyback on Sax either. Immediate dieback from him, in fact. And with the Aegis on the void, that might be it, folks. Nega might have just done it. Oh, you know, OG, they'll fight to the last minute, but unfortunately, this really is looking like it's the end of the day for them. Let's see how they can play this one. Arrows coming out in every direction. No tail. ILTW and Thompson, the only ones left to defend for the next 70 seconds. 
Miracle jumps in immediately, jumping onto the couple of the Gyrocopter, using that time walk bash combination to try and bring him down. Gyrocopter's gonna be this target. Can they kill him off? Yes, they can. No buyback on him either. They're gonna keep on chasing his RTW. He's gonna be the next target. No tail. He's gonna lose his life just outside the base. And down goes RTW as well. It's a triple kill for Miracle, and that will be it. The GG is called. Some days.